Hi, everyone. Welcome back to another edition of the Weekly Word from Prayer Booth Camp for Nations. And today I will be sharing from our newsletter, which is entitled Not Ashamed of the Gospel. You know, and uh, just uh, think about it. As human beings, we love to be acknowledged, whether privately or publicly. I mean, just think about it, walking into a room and you see your really good friend and suddenly that person ignores you just because maybe they're in the presence of some big celebrity or something like that. We would feel really hurt, right? Well, what Jesus is saying to us is that, you know, we need to acknowledge him publicly, uh, in the face of all our circumstances, he says in his word that therefore whoever confesses me before men, him I will also confess before my father who is in heaven. But whoever denies me before men, him I will also deny before my father who is in heaven. He, um, you know, he has promised, you know, once we acknowledge Jesus publicly, he's promised to do exactly the same thing. Now, remember that Jesus is the word of God personified. He is, you know, he, what he's saying to us is, you know, when we face circumstances, we need to speak that word of God. We need to speak the word and say, no, 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 no. Whether this word, whatever is going on in my circumstance is not the is not the will of God for me. So for instance, if you are unwell, you're sick, lying in bed, you know, things are not going well, you know, what we need to do is we need to say, no, no, Jesus died for me on the cross of Calvary. The word of God says, I am healed by the stripes of Jesus. In that way, we are acknowledging Jesus publicly in the face of this circumstance. And what happens then? Jesus, who is our high priest, he takes that word. He goes before God, our father, and he says, you know, this is my, my brother, my sister, and this is your word, Lord, and they are healed in Jesus name do you see what i mean and so that is the whole essence of us being able to acknowledge our god and king publicly to be able to say i am not ashamed of the gospel of christ listen to what paul says he said for i am not ashamed of the gospel of christ for it is the power of god unto salvation for everyone who believes for the Jew first and also for the Greek. And so, so we simply need to just stay in our lands with our high priest, Jesus Christ. Acknowledge him, acknowledge his word, acknowledge what he says about you is what is going to come to pass. He has said you are healed, therefore you are healed. He has said you are delivered, therefore you are delivered. He has said you are prosperous, therefore you are, you know, and that's what we need to do, folks. We just need to speak up. We need to represent and we need to say we are not ashamed of the gospel of Christ. Amen. Um, here at uh, Prayer Boot Camp, we are definitely never ashamed of the gospel of Christ. We have several prayer meetings through the week and we would love you to join us at any one of them. If you are still not receiving our newsletter, then please click on the subscribe button if you are listening to this on YouTube. Otherwise, send us an email email at prayerbootcamp at oasisfoundation.org.uk. Till next time then, folks, take care. God bless. Have a great week. Bye.